Welcome back to Chessington World of Adventures for our latest Jumanji update. And whilst there's no more track gone up, we will be checking the car park, hopefully, to see whether or not any more has arrived. There is quite a lot of progress in the middle of the land and indeed the station area. So the station area has been um, fabricated over the front. So those that are worried about it being just a tin shed, worry no more, the front bit is already being redone. And in the middle as well, you can now see footpath ins and you can also see uh, foliage going up and theming as we start to really become the world of Jumanji and indeed the amazing centerpiece which the park are planning for it. So stay with us on this update. We'll show you what we can from the site as it progresses here at Chesington World of Adventures. Close to the BNM wing coaster coming to Chesington. A few people said they don't like the green. I'm actually quite pleased it's not just black and grey, to be honest with you. Look at it, that. One of the earliest fabricated pieces. We saw some of this track last week. There is a little bit more arrived. And we will show you some of those pieces down there shortly. So this is one of the new pieces that's arrived. And I'd probably argue, look, we're gonna have, uh, see they're gonna have some kind of trim break. Or stopper put on these. Of course, track 21 we saw last week. But again, these bits are new as well. And when we go down the bottom, you'll see just how many pieces have arrived. In fact, look, that is the final piece cut. Is it? It's green on the end. So that there is the final piece. So yeah, looking at this end, this is piece 37. So this for me, this is the spike, the final piece of the Jumanji puzzle is this here. Of course the green on the end gives it away. But yeah, more track, more track down here. So some of this we saw last week. Tracks 23, 24, all sitting, waiting to go on. Fabricated on the 12th of September. Now we did see these pieces last week, but just to show them again, because you can see sort of the switch around point where it goes from one direction to the other. Obviously the track, the back track is upside down, but you can see where it switches round. So as it comes out of the inline sort of G0 roll, goes down to the left, it's gonna switch back left and right before going around the statue. We certainly think that is the piece there for it. Now we'll show you a bit of sight and then we'll take you down and show you that I think all the track is now here at Chesington. 
We did show you from the other side a lot of the plantation is going in and you can see it from here as well. And you can see the paths are going in. Lots of paths. The plants and the area is really starting to all of a sudden come to life. course the inversion. Now the stairs are in place of course going up over the station. We did say the front of the station has been fabricated and the roof has also been done and finished off up the top. So whilst I think it will keep that design I think the front of the building particularly where it launches is going to look very different and again we can see all the planting and vegetation as the centerpiece it's going to come to life quite early. So the piece we saw over there would be expected, I think, to come down to this bit uh, facing up before it rolls back down and launches through the station. It's one end. Now we are under some kind of debate about the numbering of this. Now my understanding is number one will be in the station or in this case pre-station because obviously this is going to come out and launch back. Now we saw track number five up the top and we can see that down here that this one here which we will get a better view of is track number three. But this is the rest of the track that's been delivered down here. We'll get another view in a minute from around the other side. There are a couple more bits down there as well. And there's more track, as you can see here, arrived in the car park. With some of the bits already here, there's some bits under wraps. But I think it's all here. There we have it, the final piece of the puzzle. I believe it's going to come out the station at a slight curvature because of the area and then blast back through the station. That's my belief on this. Obviously only time will tell. But I think all the track is here now. I think all the track has arrived here at Chesington World Adventures. Are you excited yet? Are you excited seeing it go up and all of the BM track being here? I certainly am. I can't see any supports in here either now, so I think it's all ready. Another exciting update here from Chesington World Adventures. Thank you for joining us here on UK Theme Parks, and we'll see you next time.